In the heart of Kenya, amidst the vibrant colors and bustling energy of the marketplace, a woman stood out. Her name was Wangari Mathai, and she was about to change the course of history. Wangari Mathai was a trailblazer, a visionary, a woman who refused to accept the status quo. She was a scientist, an activist, and an environmentalist, but above all, she was a fighter. Hey there, the African Time Machine here. Welcome to yet another video. Please subscribe if you like our content, like, and leave a comment. It will help the channel a lot. Wangari Mathai was a Kenyan environmental activist and politician who founded the Greenbelt Movement, an organization dedicated to planting trees and promoting environmental conservation. Born in Nyeri, Kenya in 1940, Mathai was the first woman in East and Central Africa to earn a PhD, receiving her degree in biology from the University of Nairobi in 1971. She became involved in politics and social activism in the 1980s, advocating for democratic reforms and women's rights in Kenya. In 1977, Mathai founded the Greenbelt Movement, which encouraged rural Kenyan women to plant trees as a way to combat deforestation and soil erosion. The movement grew rapidly, and by 2004 had planted over 30 million trees in Kenya and other countries. Mathai's environmental work often put her at odds with the Kenyan government, and she was arrested and beaten by police several times. Despite this, she continued to advocate for environmental conservation and democracy and was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize in 2004 for her contribution to sustainable development, democracy, and peace. Mathai served as a member of parliament in Kenya from 2002 to 2007 and continued to promote environmental activism and women's rights until her death in 2011. Her legacy continues to inspire environmentalists and activists around the world, and the Greenbelt Movement continues to plant trees and promote environmental conservation in Kenya and beyond. Thank you for sticking around till the end. See you on the next one.